Hey guys, welcome to the channel. This video is going to be about a couple of Chrome extensions that we can use to share the screenshots of your web pages or the browser screen. This video is for you if you use Chrome. If you like the content, please do like and subscribe to the channel. The name of the first Chrome extension is Lightshot Chrome Extension. So if you open your browser and search for the Lightshot Chrome extension, I've already searched for it, you will see a link on the, sh on the top. If you click on that, you will see the Chrome extensions tab. You will be redirected to this Lightshot Screenshot Tool extension. You can see it has got a good rating and a good number of reviews. So it's good and safe to use. It's been downloaded by over 200 thousand people so you can click on add chrome extension so now you can see the extension is already added to my chrome and here i'm pretty sure you know here's how you can access the extension so once it's installed and you click on it and you want to take a screenshot of a particular section or maybe the entire screen this part of the screen now I've got two panels on the right side I've got a panel that I can use to edit the screenshot and on bottom I got this panel that I can use to save the screenshot copy it uh, print it share it search similar images on Google share it with anyone on social networks or upload to their server so that I can just copy the URL and share it with anyone. So let's see what these editing tools are so I can draw freely over here with anything you want to highlight this part I can do that. We can draw a line, straight line. It could be for any person. I want to highlight a button on the page. I need this shape for something. I need this highlighter to highlight the number of people that I've downloaded this could be used for anything it could be you have these you know tools that you can use to edit your screenshot and now the best part that I love is if I this is just a temporary screenshot that I don't need on my system so I don't really have to download it or save it I can just click on this cloud icon and this will be uploaded on their server and I can just copy this URL on the top and I can share it with anyone. So even if I paste it in another window, you can see it will load the screenshot with all the edits that I made. It's pretty convenient, right? So that's the first extension that I really like. And the second extension that I really like is the Go Full Page. There may be a time when you don't really need a particular section screenshot. You may need the full page to download or share with anyone else. Maybe you want to tell them something about the website. Maybe you like the web page that you want to use uh, for, your, for your landing pages or something like that. You can go for this extension, go full page. It has got pretty good rating. And it's been down, you know, it's been downloaded by 600,000 people, so it's pretty safe to use. You can again click on Add Chrome. I have already installed it. So let's say I want to take screenshot of this entire page. Maybe I won't be able to take it because it's a Chrome extension page. Let's open another page. Let's just open this Yahoo page. I want to take screenshot of the entire page, but not a particular section. So I'll just go to this extension. I'll click on it and it will take screenshot of the entire page not a particular section and now you can click on edit you can make any kind of edits you'd like to you have all these options over here you can add stickers you can do other kinds of edits you can add arrows finding out something right and now once you are done with your edits you can just go back you can just click on download image you can just click on download PDF you have two options you can download it as a PDF or you can download as image right so these are two great extensions that 
I use for my regular work to download the screenshots, to download the full pages whenever I need it. That's it. So now you can download these extensions in your browser and make use of it. I have shared the link in the description below. And if you have anything you would like to add, please let me know in the comments below. Make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel and share it with others. See you in the next video.